win to win. <laughs> Ow. Ow. Okay, now it's cold. Now I need to do this. Uh, uh, uh. I have a bunch of <laughs> heat resistant stuff. All right, eat this one. Num, delicious. Run. Let's see how you fare in between these trees, stupids. Serpentine. You got nothing. Uh oh. Oh, he coming at me. Oh, I need snow boots. I run slow in snow. Slide. He's coming. Ah. Ooh. He coming for me. Oh, I found a fire. I didn't need to eat that food at all. Hi, friend. Excuse me, young traveler, but I may be so bold. You look quite troubled. Perhaps a glimpse into what your future holds will bring you comfort to your spirit. That is, may I tell your fortune? Sure. If you're a Yiga clan, I'm going to be mad. Ah, very good. Now let me see. I see red. A crimson. Deep and rich. It's the most beautiful color I've ever seen. Oh, it's the color of your blood. Now die. It's a Yiga clan. You suck. Eat it. Stamp, 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 stamp. Yeah. Ow. Rude. Thank you, Mifa. Give me your bananas. Get out of here. Death from above. Nope. Doesn't work. Can you kindly fuck off? Just, yeah, watch what happened. Blam! Hanzo. I'm gonna steal your horse. Wait, where's where's my skeleton? hand? Yeah. Eh. Eh. Stealing this stuff. No, my arm broke. All right, stabby thing. These are my rocks. Stay away, Bacoblin. Oh, he's chasing his horse down. That's funny. That's good to know. You knock them off their horse, they go for their horse. <gasps> horse. He's kind of stupid. His horse is right there. Alright, I'm hearing something weird upstairs. Hold on a second, guys. Never mind, it was apparently a, a buddy making the loudest noise possible going to take a shower. I thought it was Jada scratching the, the floor upstairs, but Jada's literally right at my feet. I got here. So I play those, what is the fate of the timeline? This, so, according to the timeline, this is the very last one. Alright. Evacuation hut. Whether you've come to Heber Mountain to shield surf the slopes, hunt treasure, and make a walk, you must remember this mountain will kill you. Accident rate on this mountain is too much to measure, and before anything else, you must just appropriately blah 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 blah. Okay. I think he's just telling me don't. Eh. Okay. Can we be done? Okay. Um. So, yeah, this would be the final one, and from what I gather, um. I'm breaking all my stuff. It's, uh, it's the last one, and Ganon essentially finally won, I guess you say, um, and pretty much wiped everything out, and he got reincarnated to, like, a, a being of just pure malice, and he's just a big flying pig monster thing. Um, and, uh, Rhino! <laughs> Wish I could ride him. Look how cool he is. But yeah, Ganon essentially finally won and just wiped out pretty much the world. Okay. Sorry, horse. Hi, horse. 
uh, and what's the story so far? Um, so essentially, um, so here you go. Let's let's find him. So that is a divine beast, and what happened is as a last last dish effort to try to seal Ganon away, uh, Zelda knew she had power to. She she's the the descendant that was blessed with the gift to seal the darkness or whatever, seal Ganon, right? And in a last ditch effort to seal away Ganon, um, the Sheikah people made four of these divine beasts, these giant mechanical flying beasts and thousands upon thousands of little mechanical things that shoot laser beams. And then, so they were going to a final assault on Ganon, but he had a plan of his own and he essentially infected all the Sheikah technology and turned them against everyone else. So they brought him to his side. So, um, in doing so, each divine beast had a champion associated to it. So, um, the Gerudo, the Rito, which are the people here, they're bird people, the Gorons, and the one I did, uh, the Zora. They all have a divine beast. And they have a champions that like pilot them. And uh, Ganon essentially went in, took over the divine beasts, and then the champions themselves fell. And uh, Link actually was battling Ganon, and he got a fatal uh, wound. Fatal wound? That doesn't sound right. Uh, one that essentially should have killed him. And um, but somehow he got rescued out of it, and then he got put to sleep in a shrine for a hundred years to heal and he's the only one left alive and so what my mission is now is i need to go take back the divine beasts to help me fight ganon now what's cool about this game is you can choose not to go take the divine beasts back and i kind of don't want to do a spoiler because we're going to be going in there here soon but uh so i'm going to avoid that part and remind me if you're still here after we take the the divine beast back i'll tell you the the spoilery part um but you can choose not to fight them or not to free them and if you don't ganon is harder uh when you go fight him that's part of it but uh let's get up there <laughs> all right let's um How do I get to it? I forget. I got the mission. Hello. Right? I got the mission to um do the divine beast from the old owl guy, right? I love the music here. Like, does anyone else get um full metal alchemist vibes from this music? Listen to it. Like the part where he's like, we're just humans. Tiny little insignificant humans. Do, do, do. And it's like there's a little fluty part. I think I've seen that anime far too much. That's a lie. You can't see Full Metal Alchemist too much. It's a great anime. If you've not seen it, go see it. And if you have not seen it, I recommend you watch the first seven episodes of the normal original Full Metal Alchemist. And then. Transition to Full Metal, Full Metal Alchemist Brotherhood. And, uh, do that. Because it's awesome. You were thinking Full Metal? All right. All right. It's not just me. Fantastic. Love that anime. I'm, I'm constantly rewatching on Netflix because Netflix keeps losing good stuff. So I just go through rotation. Uh, I watched Full Metal. <laughs> I think five times in three months all the way through. And it's just like, well, there's nothing else to watch. No, 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 no. Okay. And also, so like that little green ring you saw, that is my stamina ring. I don't know how much you know about this game cereal, so I'm just kind of speaking. Um, but you only start with this, the fat inner ring at the beginning. And as you complete shrines that you saw, I got that spirit orb. Those are used for upgrades. And you can spend four of them to get one upgrade and it's either a heart or it's like a fraction of one of the rings and it's usually about uh, like a third of it. 
And so I've spent all my upgrades on stamina so I can just climb for days and it's awesome. Because there's so much you can access in this game. Like, this is something I've said on stream before, but it bears... Oh, there's going to be something in there. Like, look at this. Look at this world, right? Everything the light touches is our kingdom. Um, so all that you see here is actually physical world that you can get to. There's nothing off limits. There's no world barrier, you know, invisible wall. Like those peaks right there. Like, yeah, even those trees. Like, uh, that's probably a Korok thing. But you can climb all these walls and get to everything that you see. And it's freaking awesome. Like this, like this weird jutting up of rock. You know, I'm just, you know, what? I have enough stamina. I'm going to climb it. You can get to everything and it's freaking awesome. And this is only part of it. Like we're actually surrounded by a lot of high areas. That, look at that. That in the background, that is like an actual rainstorm going on with a cloud with lightning and stuff going on. And you actually can see the lightning strikes. I don't know if you guys can because it's a smaller screen. But like this is all real time happening in the world. That's Hyrule Castle with all the red stuff gooping around. Hey, look what I found. All right, I need to do this. I'm going to boop this. Yeah, we got a Korok buddy. Yeah, the dragons are awesome. Um, we ran across Laneru a bunch in one stream, so that's Death Mountain. Um, and I, I think Laneru is the only dragon I've seen on this play. But yeah, all this stuff you can literally get to, and it's freaking amazing, massive, and just all exploratory. Like you can just climb it. Whoa, check it out. I need to get in that. <laughs> That's what he said. Eh. Let's hear it. I love seeing the little thunderstorms because here, you know, once I get up to somewhere safe, I want to. I want to look at it. With my lens. Like, check it out, dude. It's freaking cool. And those are actual lightning strikes. Like, if I was over there, that shit would almost hit me. So, and it will hit you. Especially if you're wearing metal. Then it sucks. And since I'm on hard mode, everything pretty much one-shots me. And what's cool is when we actually get in this bird, he's living in the real world. He's not in an instance. You know, you're not just teleported somewhere and if you fall off of him, you go boo and teleport back in. You would literally fall all the way down until you hit the ground. It's freaking awesome. And there, really, there's no Korok up here? I find that hard to believe. Let's put on our mask just to make sure. Really? I climbed all the way up here and there's nothing? <gasps> Rude. There's a shadow. And also what, something I love about this game too is um, if you're when this happened last stream, I was just walking down there in the midday and uh, the bird is actually casting a giant shadow on the ground. And it's dependent on where the the sun and stuff is pretty awesome. All those little touches. And I was trying to do a, a little Korok puzzle where you put a bunch of apples, a little thing, and it summons a Korok. And <laughs> I had a Pona and I jumped off her. And the turd walks over and tried to eat one of the apples. <laughs> oh, that, that part cracked me up. Where is that? bowl thing I wanted to jump in. There it is. I gotta know this. Oh, I gotta go meet, um... 
I got I remember I need to go meet some bird person and convince him not to go into the divine beast alone yeah this is what I mean one of the apple puzzles so you offer up an apple because there's an apple in that one and you'd be like yeah here's an apple and you get a Korok friend and there was one with three statues and two of them had an apple and I had to put one down and opponent walked up and chomped on one <laughs> cracked me up thank you I'm taking those oh that's a good weapon no it's not okay I thought that was my um what's it called my duality blade I would have cried all right we good it switched to a better weapon damn it what was that noise Butterfly ran by me or something. All right, so we need to go find. Um, is it a side quest? I don't think it's a side quest. The bird in the mountains. No, that was a little girl. Destroy again in the hero sword, divine beast. Here you go. This is the one I want you to do. Teba's wife Saki may know where he is. Ask about Rita Village. Okay, I need to find Saki. All right, we gotta look for a person named Saki. Saki, is it you? Ow! Monster circling around the village. Sure. The wound here on my ring? I got shot by the thing in the sky. Divine Beast Bob Mendo. Look at his punk hair. Legend has that the monster was once a protector of the village, but then blah, 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 blah. You're not helpful. Now. All right. I need to find Saki. Saki! Is it you? Nope. There's the owl dude. I like him. He's cool. And you can shield surf in this game, which is awesome. It's one of the most satisfying parts of the game. Where is this lady? Not you. I'm too poor to afford your armor. Stupid fairy fountains taking all my money. Not you. Hello. Oh, there's actually people here. Oh, dude, they're not even sharing a bed. That's wife and husband. Is she mad? Oh, cool. I can zoom in more. All right. Good figure it out from here. Hey, let's upgrade. Oh, wait. I kind of want to stay on the three heart run, guys. Kind of like that. Stay on the three heart run. Until I get enough to like just get all of a sudden 15 hearts so then I can get the um What's it called the master sword I need that at some point She's like at the top or something <laughs> Hello Just bust into some hotel room It's all good Also Taking off this mask, I don't need that anymore. Plus, I like cooler with my bandana. All right, it's in the center ring. So where is she? 
suck it. All right, she should be right around here. 